Hey y'all, hey people, welcome back to another video here. Today, I am gonna be doing the Holly Jolly Christmas YouTube tag video. I am just gonna be answering a handful of questions about the holiday season. The first question, favorite Christmas movie? Yeah, I don't think I really have a favorite Christmas movie. I don't have a favorite Christmas movie, but I really do enjoy the Princess Switch series. All three of the movies, they're all on Netflix and Vanessa Hudgens is in it. So I think that's why I really enjoy it. But other than that, I don't think I have like an actual like favorite Christmas movie that I would want to watch. Are you on the naughty list or the nice list? The nice list? Okay, show us an embarrassing Christmas photo. I do not have an embarrassing Christmas photo, but I do have an embarrassing photo. Like, I think I was six or seven years old when I first started cheering, and I was trying to, I don't know if I was going into a split or coming out of a split. It's not too embarrassing, but have you ever had a white Christmas? Yes, for the past like six and a half years, I had a white Christmas, but I'm not having a white Christmas this year because I moved back to Georgia. But I really wish I should have just stayed in Minnesota for like the holiday season because I actually enjoy the snow this time of year. Do you start your Christmas shopping on Black Friday or you wait until the last minute? So actually this year was my first time Black Friday shopping. When I've shopped in the past, I have I think I've always done it like before Christmas. I don't like to do last minute stuff, so it's always on Black Friday or before. If you could be in any Christmas movie, what would it be? Probably this Christmas because I really like all of the actors and the actresses in that movie. Name all of Santa's reindeer. Rudolph Prancer or Presley or I can't, I can't. I'm not even gonna try and fake it. I can't. Let me just look him up right quick. Okay, actually I was close. So Dasher, Dancer, Prancer, Vitsen, Comet, Cupid, Donner, Blitzen, and of course Rudolph. When does your family put up your Christmas tree and who decorates it? I've put up three or four, maybe three Christmas trees this year. I've gone to like my other cousins and auntie's house to help put up their tree and decorate it, but I also think that's just because I haven't been here in two years, so it was kind of cool to do that, but usually I, I don't. Is your Christmas tree real or fake? That's a good question. Is that real? I think it's fake. I don't know, bro, but I, it might be fake. Picking at gifts or be surprised? Definitely growing up, I would pick at my gifts, um, but I would rather be surprised. Show us your ugly Christmas sweater if you have one. I don't have a Christmas sweater. I don't think I've ever owned an ugly Christmas sweater. If you could be under the mistletoe with anyone, who would it be with? I would say Justin Bieber, but he's married. I respect his marriage and I love Hailey Bieber, so it can't be him. I would also say Taylor Lautner too, but I think he just got engaged. So maybe like one of my best friends just because I think it, that would be funny. Does your family have a special holiday recipe you like to help make? No, I'm gonna attempt to make some vegan brownies. Yeah, there's no really special like cakes or anything. I mean, there are. I'm not a big dessert eater. I don't think I've ever really been into cakes and pies, but I'll be making my own this year. Are you a pro present rapper or do you fail miserably? I've actually never had to wrap presents until this year, and my aunt taught me how to wrap them. They're not that hard. They're not as hard as I thought they would be. Uh, I did wrap some presents for myself like two years ago when I was in college, but those are just so ugly. Ever gone Christmas caroling? No. No, I haven't, but I want to. What tops your tree? There's a star on our tree right now. Do you make New Year's resolutions? Do you stick to them? I actually don't, not anymore, just because I feel like you don't necessarily need to put a time frame just for a certain event to like set goals. I do that on a daily anyway, but you have been granted one Christmas wish. What will it be? If I had one Christmas wish, should I even say that? No, um, I think I would want to spend the holidays with like all of my best friends that are in Europe right now, which will happen sometime soon. But that would be my one wish, is to be around like all of my friends that I've traveled with and that I've met while I was living in Spain. You know, I would really wanna be in Norway right now. Joseph, I miss you. I really wanna be in Oslo for Christmas. That would be my wish, if it could be granted. I would be in Oslo and I will have a white Christmas. What makes the holidays special for you? For me, I think just being like 
grateful and appreciative and cheerful. I've spent Christmases like alone and I've also spent them working. I've also spent them around like my other friends and their families. So I think just like being in a loving environment and good food, okay? Favorite holiday song. My favorite holiday song would be Christmas Eve by Justin Bieber. Hello or Underneath the Mistletoe, once again by Justin Bieber, because I just love all of his songs. Favorite holiday makeup trend. Ooh, I'm just gonna post pictures of them. I am nowhere near having the artistic ability of doing makeup for like holiday trends, so I'm just gonna post a bunch of pictures that are on my Pinterest boards. Where do you usually spend your holiday? Every year is different, but now I'm back home in Georgia. Last year, I was working, so I was in North Dakota. The year before that, I was in Spain. The year before that, I was <laughs> somewhere else. Like, every year is different. Must have winter essentials. Body cream, like some sort of like a, a body lotion because my skin gets really dry. Beanies, those are my absolute must haves. Probably like my Glossier lip gloss because I wear a lot of matte lipsticks in the winter. Gloves, mittens, what else? I think that really just might be like the essentials for me. What would be your dream place to visit for the holiday season? Um, Oslo. Oslo, Norway. That would be my dream place. Either Oslo or probably like, I don't know, maybe like Scotland, like Edinburgh, Scotland, because I've been looking at a lot of YouTube videos and just like Instagram pictures of how it looks during the holidays and it looks so pretty and perfect. Or even like somewhere in Amsterdam this time of year. Colorful lights or white lights? So right now we have a mix of colorful lights and white lights in our house, but I think I would prefer white lights. Share a family holiday tradition. Nothing really special. Um, it's usually somebody always like hosts a dinner and cooks for everybody and people come over to our house. Most memorable holiday moment. I probably want to say what we did Secret Santa between like my friends and I when we were in college a couple years ago, but your favorite holiday decorations? I don't have any. Have you ever been caught under a mistletoe? No, I haven't. Hands down, what's your all-time favorite holiday food and holiday sweet treat? So, like I said before, I'm not a huge like dessert eater. Maybe that'll change when I learn to bake or start baking more. Just because everywhere I go, there are not a lot of like vegan like desserts available. If I had a treat, I really like brownies. Like I really enjoy brownies and red velvet cupcakes. Well, so I think that is it for this Holly Jolly Christmas YouTube tag. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Do not forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video.